I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to find limits from the given graph. Consider the graph to answer the following questions. So we are given a piecewise function here. You need to pause the video, answer these questions with reference to the given graph. First question is, find limit of the function as x approaches 2 from the left side, find limit of the function f of x as x approaches 2 from the right side find limit of the function as x approaches 2, write value of the function at 2. And the second part of this question is, explain why the function is continuous at x equals to minus 2, but not at x equals to 2. So you can pause the video, write down your answers, and then look into my suggestions. Let's begin with the very first one. Limit of this function as x approaches 2 from negative side. Negative means left side. So that's the point 2. So if I'm approaching from the left side, I'm actually on this graph, right? So I reach where? I'm reaching or I'm approaching the value 2, right? So this value is plus 2 for me. If I'm approaching from the positive side, that means from the right side, I hit this part of the graph and I'm approaching 0. So this value is 0. Limit of the function as x approaches 2. So as you approach 2 from both the sides, you see you approach different values. Since these two values are not same, this value does not exist, correct? Because the first two, the previous two are not same. Write f of 2. That means the value of the function at 2. So at 2, the filled in hole is at y equals to 2. So, so 2 is the va value at Explain why the function is continuous at x equals to minus 2. Now let's look at minus 2. Here what you see is limit of the function as x approaches minus 2 from the negative side is what? From the negative side you approach a value 2, right? So when you approach from here, you approach a value 2. Is it okay? So this is 2. Similarly, the limit of the function when x approaches minus 2 from the positive side, that means if you're approaching from here, then also you approach the value 2. So that limit is also plus 2. Since you see these two limits are same, limit exists. So what we can say is that the limit of the function as x approaches minus 2 is indeed equals to 2. Now this is the first part, that limit should exist. Then second part is, what is the value of the function at minus 2? value of the function at minus 2 is 2, correct? Since limit of the function at minus 2 is equal to the value of the function at minus 2, we say that the function is continuous. Is it okay? At x equals to minus 2. Perfect. So that is the reason why it is continuous at x equals to minus 2. On the other hand, what you saw is that the limit of the function does not exist at 2. Therefore, it is discontinuous. And it is different for approaching from left to right. And this kind of discontinuity which we have here is called jump discontinuity. Correct. So that is how you could explain such questions. I hope that helps. Thank you. And all the best.